Hey guys, Anthony here with a tutorial on how to customize your Firefox Quantum user interface. Mozilla released Firefox Quantum on November 14, 2017, and it has a new user interface called Photon. I like the minimalistic design of Photon, though I don't like certain aspects of the UI. But the good news is that we can customize it. This is what my default user interface looked like when I first updated to Firefox Quantum. And this is what it looks like after I customize it. I used a lighter theme and rearranged and changed some of the icons in the toolbar. So let me show you how. First of all, instead of this bookmarks sidebar icon, I want to have my regular bookmarks icon. To do so, click on the menu icon in the top right corner and choose customize. You will see all these icons in the customize area. And here is the bookmarks menu icon. You can drag and drop the bookmarks icon in the toolbar like so. Similarly, you can remove the bookmarks sidebar icon by dragging and dropping it in this area like so. I would also like to move the home and refresh icons from the left to the right. So I can just drag and drop both the icons from one side to the other like so. One more thing is that I don't like this blank space here. And another way to remove a specific item from the toolbar is to right click on it and then choose remove from toolbar. In the customize section, you can also change your themes by choosing one of these or getting more themes. I'm going to choose the light theme. Also under density, you can change the density of your user interface. If you want the menu bar at the top, right click in this area up top and then choose menu bar. I don't want the menu bar so I've removed it. Similarly, you can display your bookmarks toolbar by right clicking and choosing the bookmarks toolbar option. Click the done button at the bottom right corner once you're done customizing. And this is what my customized Firefox Quantum UI looks like. Well, these are just some of the ways you can customize Firefox Quantum. If you've got any questions, feel free to leave them in the comment section. Thanks for watching.